Okie dokie friend, well good news, everything went uh, according to plan, um, everything's working just the way it should. Now uh, real quick I'm going to go over the, the channel monitor, I want to show, make sure that you can see that everything's working just the way it should, so there's your throttle, there's channel 4, there's channel 2, and there's channel 1 working just the way it should. Uh, switches. Make sure you can see that. Notice how channel 5, the switch goes from positive to negative. So that's a good thing. Channel 6, going to go from positive to negative. 100, negative 100. Mixed channel. You'll notice three values I set up there. So midway, negative and 100%. Likewise with channel 8. And if we go down, you'll notice the other switches as well. Channel 9 and channel 10 is a three-way switch for flight mode. As for these uh, things right here, I don't know how to test them. So sorry about that friend. I'm not familiar with these at all. Now you'll notice I'm a little cumbersome when I'm running around the Devo 10 and Devo 7e. I'm not used to the setup of using buttons. Alright, so Devo. Let's go ahead and initialize the Devo. Good to go. Whoops. All right, while we're on it, let's go ahead and check the spectrum. DSM X, if I'm not mistaken. See if that works. No, it looks like I might be running out of battery. That's not good. Hopefully I have just enough battery. Actually, let me charge the battery real quick. All right, turns out that there's nothing wrong with the battery. I just have a huge dead band here. So yeah, everything's working just the way it should for your surf module, which is your stock module that came with your radio. So again, good news. And now for the Hubson. Hubson. And it bound up. So your A seven one zero A seven one zero five module is working just the way it should as well. Last but not least, this is going to be your NRF module. This is a WL Toys 272. So, I'm going to go to V202. Turn it on. And it bound right up. No problemo. 
All right, so your NRF module is working, your A7105 module is working, no issues. Um, and of course your stock surf module has no issues neither, so everything's working just the way it should. Um, all the channels are there. Now I did notice that this switch right here was, uh, was spongy when I first put everything back together. It looks like well, from the factory it came out a little bit loose. I went ahead and tightened it up for you. However, I suspect that it might uh, break later on down the road because from what I saw it looked like the, the metal clamps weren't doing their job. I went ahead and included an extra one from an from this uh, radio I have here. You can see I salvaged the radio. I went ahead and gave you this mixer switch, this uh, switch right here. So in case it ever goes bad on you, you can just go ahead and swap it out and you'll be good to go.